All right, everybody, I am uh, doing another review today on the white peach. This is uh, what it looks like here. Uh, I don't have a whole ton of information on it, uh, but it is not a super productive plant, but it is uh, a pretty good producer from what I've understood. Uh, I heard it is also a very popular pepper. Um, to use Kang's term, it's a possibly a snacking pepper. I watched uh, Dave's review from uh, Growing at Home in West Virginia to see if I could get any more info on them. And uh, I really couldn't get much or find much about them. Uh, I do want to say that if everybody likes peppers, check out the Pepper Lovers community on Google+. Plus. But uh, this here is what the inside looks like. Lots of seeds. I'm going to get some more light on that. A lot of seeds. Good chunk of placenta in the one. I can smell it from here. I'm a couple feet away from it. It's got kind of a fruity smell to it. These aren't supposed to be very hot at all, so I'm not going to worry too much about the... But I do want some of these seeds. Oops. Let's get some of these out of here. That'll be good enough. If I can get this whole stem off of here. Feels real firm and crispy. I like that. Two more seeds, I guess. But uh here we go. It's supposed to be sweet and juicy. Oh. Mmm. It is really juicy. Wow, really, really fruity. Wow, it almost doesn't taste like a pepper at all. That is really good. Yeah, and there's, uh, from what Dave said, he said there's almost no heat. Yeah, I agree with that. There's not very much at all. Just a, a tiny little bit of warmness right here. That's about it. Um... I would definitely say it's a good snacking pepper. Again, these here are what they look like. I guess this is going to be a short review. Um, not really a whole lot to it, not a ton of information. But I would definitely give these thumbs up. Very, very tasty peppers. Thanks again, Growing at Home in West Virginia, for the order. And, again, check out Pepper Lovers Community on Google+.